Southside Elementary School in Johnson City will be hosting a fun night of basketball coming up on Monday, January 28th. The proceeds from this game will go toward helping Northside kindergarten teacher Amy Barnett as she battles against cancer. Nancy McDonald, Dr. Sharon Pickering, and Holly Booker are here to share with us more about Slam Dunk on Cancer. Big event coming up. Yes, sir. Tell us about it. Who's going to be playing? Well, it's the Now School Goodies. The Now School Goodies. People that are employed at Northside right, right. now. Okay. Versus the old school oldies, <laughs> um, folks that have worked at Northside but right. now are at other places in the school system or retired or right. W whatever. So, who do you think is going to win? First of all. Well, <laughs> I, think the, I think the real winner here is going to be Amy Barnett. Amy Barnett, right. definitely, <laughs> definitely. That's that's the main goal. Yes. And Dr. Pickery, it's got to make you feel good to, to see the Northside community come together to help out one of your own. Absolutely. We are so blessed with a uh, faculty, community, students who all love and support each other, and especially Amy during this time. Um, you know, cancer affects us all yes. in some way, and we want to try and find a way to help and support those that are in need and are going through it at the moment. So we love Amy. She's a kindergarten teacher right. at Northside. And, and um, she's just been a big part of us for about 13 years. Wow. So, um, so she is part of the family. Yes, she is. Yes. And all the proceeds they, from folks that come to the game, all those proceeds are going to help her. Yes, sir. Um, we're going to have just donations there. Mm -hmm. um, and all of that will go towards um, Amy as she travels to Houston, um, um, to Indy Anderson, and, and then has treatments here to help cover those expenses. Right. Um, you know, anyone that's stayed, had someone that's been in the hospital for a while, you know that. Just food alone adds up. And so all gate receipts go to her, and then the sale of the T-shirts will go towards the American Cancer Society. And I was going to ask Holly about that because American Cancer Society doing such great work all across our region. This is just one way to help raise money to keep that work going. It, it really is. When Nancy told me that she had this idea about doing Slam Dunk Cancer, I got super excited. Um, it's super fun, um, and obviously it supports Amy also, which is really great. So um, we're really happy to be part of it. Tell us about the T-shirt. Tell us about where you got the idea for the logos and all that stuff. Um, well, it's blue for Amy. Amy. Amy has colon cancer, so right. we did blue, and we're going right. to try to have a blue out, so we hope everybody can show up in their blue and right. support, and she can see that everybody's there for it. Um, and then everything else was pretty much Nancy. I feel like she needs to take credit for all of it. It was her <laughs> idea, and her. she's really inspired the whole thing. Um, but yeah, uh, we are. it is for colon cancer awareness, and uh, as an American Cancer Society representative, we do try to make sure that people are aware right. um, of our HPV vaccine, because colon right. cancer is one of the cancers that it can prevent. Um, and make sure you're getting screened regularly and talking to your doctor because we are all about prevention. So if you have any questions at the game, just feel free to come up and talk. Y'all are going to be there available, answer, ready to answer any questions yeah. that folks might have. Yep. So it's you not only get great, this is going to be such a fun event, but yeah. it's f such a great cause. I mean, you're looking to have some fun here, aren't you? <laughs> um, entertainment, if you're looking for like a UT ball game, no, no, no. we're not that. No, no, no. no. But, um, you know, we have folks like Jovan Johnson, this old school that yeah. we played in Europe, right. playing against like our music teacher, Wesley Harris, who um, has been practicing diligently um, and, and getting a vocabulary list to understand how this game is played. Wow, so very good. there's a lot of excitement. Um, the Unity Dance Team from Science Hill is going yes. to come perform at half. So you're going to have the, the dance teams and the cheerleaders yes, there as well? Oh. Yeah. Cheerleaders, bring it on. I mean, <laughs> our old school cheerleaders are, are serious. They have totally prepared. Now, my question for you ladies, are, are you on the court as, as ball players or as cheerleaders? I want to know. I'm the referee, so. <laughs> You're just keeping everything fair. Uh, keeping, well, every, keeping it all fair. Fun. Let's uh, say fun. Let's, um, fair and fun. <laughs> let's go there. Again, the two paradigms. We have Richard Church, who's been a Tita Blessed Belay right. official, and he is yes. a former principal yeah. at Northside. He's going to be an official. And then we have Dr. Pickering. <laughs> he doesn't really know basketball. <laughs> so right. it'll be fun for me. Ladies, thank you all so much for stopping by. This is going to be a fun much. event for a great, great cause. Helping out a, a teacher, Amy Barnett, right there. It's Slam Dunk on Cancer. Monday, January 28th, 6.30 p.m. right there at Northside Elementary School.